How do, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Pal World. And you join me on this beautiful day in Pal World with all my pals building my walls around my pal base. Oh, hell yeah. Hope you guys are all right, as always. Hope you're having a fantastic day. Um, so, a lot of things have happened <laughs> since our first episode of Pal World. Uh, and the easiest way to describe it is bustly. We decided to make a server. It turns out some of the boys wanted to play as well. So, we made a server for Power World. And we are now currently playing on a actual online server. Um, what also happened is we did a live stream. So, if you haven't seen it already, you, you should go and watch it. We did a live stream. This is where we built the base originally on the first playthrough when we started it. Um, and this is where we are following the live stream. So, I'm pretty much in a very similar place as where I was going to be following some of the videos that I'd already yeah. recorded ready for you guys. So, let me just grab this egg and start grabbing some ore. And I'm going to explain to you what's happened. We all decided to build in different ends of the world. The idea here is, is that we're all going to have different bases in different places. We can use each other's fast travel points or whatever. And we can uh, kind of just explore the entire world of Pal World. As you can see, I've gone for the top left, which is the ice slash snow. Being a Viking... That's where I want to be. I want to be within all the snow and all this stuff. That is where I have built. Uh, Liney has built over in this area. And Mikey has built down in uh, this area. There's quite a few of us playing it at the minute. I've got a feeling Gibbs is going to join us as well. So some of the other boys as well. Uh, we have had a raid. Which is uh, something to kind of discuss. A raid happens when we have man-eating beasts that come and try and get to us. Now oh, I'm over encumbered. This always happens. No. Can't. Oh, no. It's going to be an issue. I don't have anything. I'm just going to have to fall off the end while I talk to you. So, um, we had man eating animals or pals that want to try and come and eat our ass. Um, and they failed massively. But um, Liney was saying that when he was playing it, he had um, some fangirls, which is one of the. Um, one of the pals they're quite overpowered and uh they had he had like five of them come and absolutely wreck his base i don't really want that to happen mm -hmm. so in the true way the true, true trope of arc survival vault why can i not close this bloody gate there we go in the true trope of arc survival vault we have used gates to create a wall if this is an Ark Survival Evolved, I don't know what it is. The good news is we are capturing pals. We're back up to kind of like I say we were um, in my uh, single player playthrough. And uh, this is technically only episode two. We've still got lots of building to do and lots of stuff. I've got a pal that's stuck over there. Uh, Flack. He's stuck. Uh, no, he's not. He's just a little bit, a little bit uh, special, shall we say. Uh, I got a deer. An ichthyr deer. Really, really cool. I uh, just need to make a saddle for it. Um, the telephant is doing all sorts of nonsense. Uh, we've got some Limux, which are sick. Uh, they are brilliant. They do everything. They do absolutely everything. And we're getting to a place now where we've got an actual bit of a base place. Uh, we've got a flyer, but we don't have a saddle for it. So the plan is today is to get into the air, get flying around, and let's see what it's about. But firstly, I need to drop off all my stuff into one of the chests that I've strategically placed in the middle to make it easier for the pals to get around without realizing just how far it is me when I'm over. Oh my god. So here is a brief update of what we've got in terms of our pals. We actually have a human. <laughs> Syndicate thug. Yes, you can capture humans. No, you definitely shouldn't. It's against the Geneva Convention. But here we are still. Uh, I need to put a one of these bad boys out. I need to do my fire thing. Uh, they're called rubies. I don't have the little fox thing. My best boy, which is really frustrating. But I do have this instead. I've got lots of wax. Uh, only one uh, penguin, a few lamb balls, a few cativas, only one chickpea, um, l l lift monk, lift monk, quite a few of those, they're doing some stuff, teethants, they're doing some stuff, cremis is absolutely brilliant for um, getting wool, really, really good, you put the cremis, the cremis in, and they just get like, if I can, like, 30 wool every night, it's ridiculous, celeraes, we've got, we've got ichthyodea, got a spare one as you can see there's one here is a bit clumsy but i've got another one here we've also got the nightwing as i said which is excellent we've got the univolt which is also a mount we found this boy as well let me show you this big boy he's called the sweeper uh, and we also got a uh, kelpsy as well so we've we've caught quite a few things uh the the ruby's sick i mean there should be a root yeah ruby over here look just melting all the stuff look 
absolutely loving it. And they're really powerful, but they're a little bit like glass cannons. The Dire Howl, we can make a um, saddle for. Apparently, they're very fast. So we are going to try the Dire Howl. Mm. We've got a Mel Pack. Oh, I love the Mel Packer. It's so cool. You can ride the Mel Packer, and it shoots air cannons. Like so. And, uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. I, I do actually quite like the, the uh, Mel Pack. That's a pretty cool animal. As I say, Lift Monk. And then the Sweeper. This is this oh. boy. He's a big boy. <laughs> He's a big boy. You can ride him, apparently. Um, so looking at the technology, this is kind of where we are with it. I've got the Tundra outfit just because it's a bit cold where I am. Um, Malpaca saddle we've got. The Dire, dire Howl saddle is the next thing that I want, but we do need some Palladium fragments. Not an issue because we've got a, a grind. I'm going to show you how that works in just a second. I haven't gone for anything that is aesthetics just yet. Because I think we're going to do that when we've got a bit more points spare. Um, and what's this? Sneak and store items. Cool. I'm not sure what the sweeper does. I feel like if I'm going to go for anything, it would probably be the Univolt I would go for. Um, and as we get further on, the Nightwing saddle, which is today's job. We want to get to level 15 and we want to get that Nightwing saddle, which is there. Uh, in order to do that, we're going to, like I say, take out the Dire Howl. Uh, we're nearly level 15 anyway, so it won't take us too long. We're going to need to make some more Pal Spheres, which, again, it shouldn't be too much of an issue. Because, again, if we just do this, how many can I make? Six. I've only got six Palladium Fragments. As you can see as well, you probably just noticed there. In terms of um, stone, I have 29 there and 100... 100 odd there. Let me put them in there. I have 155 stone. This is the impressive thing. <laughs> 8,000 wood and another 140 in here. If it is sick, you just, just headbutts the shit out of everything and we just get wood for days. It's ridiculously good. Um, but we do need to create some of these. So we can do that. I probably don't want 47 because I don't want to use all of my stone just yet. But 40 is a good whack. Let's do that, and we're going to get our teeth, and he's going to come over here, spray some water on this, and crush it to make some more palladium fragments. Uh, I'm going to get rid of the rock just in the middle here, make some more balls so we can capture them. We might even level up doing that. But today is the day we get a flyer, and we start looking at the rest of the world. I'm excited. Now, we've got enough fragments to make the dire old saddle. What we can also do is if we pull our uh, yeah. uh, lift monkey over here, look, he's going to work on it with me to make it even faster. There is um, a machine gun thing that you can get for the lift muck, so it sits on your shoulder and fires a machine gun at people, which is just ridiculous, and I'm probably going to do it. Ruby just produced 20 iron ingots for me over there, which is sick. Thank you, Ruby. Let's make this saddle. Let's go out there. I need to get more palladium, so we're probably going to need to go close to the water, but luckily we are quite close to the water. And we need to get that level 15. I've made some extra um, capture balls, which are great. The capture spears. Um, so now we can go out there and try and level 15 for the Nightwing saddle. Oh, yeah. We've got it. Now, the cool thing with these are it goes into your harnesses, um, into key items. So I've got the Mel Packer one, I've got the Ichthyodia one, and I've got a Dire Howl uh, now. So what it means is. If I go to my dire howl, our pal team's hungry. Who's hungry in my team? Oh, you're hungry. Oh, okay. Yeah, you are, you are quite hungry, actually. Let me just get some food out for this guy because he's quite hungry. Uh, I'm just going to take uh, half. I don't need half. Oops. Definitely got a lot of berries. <laughs> berries for days. Let's feed up this guy. There he is. He's happy now. He's very, very happy. Chuck this away. Dire howl. Ride. Why can't I ride you? I can ride you. Come here. Yes. Oh, God. He's a quick boy. I would like to open, please. Okay. <laughs> Just glitch through. Who know? Yeah, this guy is really, really quick, actually. This is um, very, very rapid. So we can just burn down to the um, to the sea, to the ocean. Stamina. We've already got a Nightwing, so that's cool. We'd probably want to try and get one that's got some good stats eventually. But for now, I'm happy. Just I hit this from him. Oh, I need to get off. That's fine. I'm for now, I'm just happy having a fairly fast transport. It just means I can just burn up and down here. What's he like at fighting? Stamina. Use fire fang. 
Oh shit. <laughs> that was actually quite good. I didn't think he'd be that effective, but he absolutely wrecked him. Okay, that's cool. That's great. So now it means that we can unlock the Nightwing saddle, uh, which is just here, like so. Uh, that one requires 20 leather, which I've got back at the base, I think. 10 cloth, which I think, again, I've got. 15 ingots, uh, 20 fiber, and some palladium fragments. I should have everything I need there now, just a bit more palladium. But, oh my god, how many of these are that? Oh my god. Can I... Can I... Screw them all? No. These are... Oh my god, there's so many of them. So many of them. What do I do? Fight them. Oh my god. Bro. <laughs> oh my god. The wolf is dead. The wolf is dead. Everyone, everyone panic. Oh my god. It's the worst thing I ever did. Oh, Liv Morgan. No. No, Liv Morgan is also dead. <laughs> oh my god. Whose idea was it to break up bringing 30 penguins in one area? Oh yeah, that's me. Stupid, stupid. Stupid. <laughs> Right, I think I've got enough materials now. I do need to put these guys in there to um, <laughs> get repaired because they're, they're uh, they did. Oh, they did it here. <laughs> now I need something that can build something with the handy trait. Um, I need something that's like, oh, this guy's artisan. I need this guy. You can come in here, whack. I'm gonna throw you, whack, at oh, this. Man. You, sir. Oh, I need one more fiber. As if. I need one more fiber. We're going to grab one more fiber and then we're going to build this beast and we're going to take off into the air. Once night time has passed, obviously, I'll fly in the dark like a rebel. Here we go. That production. Whack. Build for me. Oh, yeah. This is, this is going to take a minute. This is going to take a minute. And we'll be back after this short commercial break. He's done it. Whack has made my Nightwing saddle. I also got the Syndicate the footing out because he's just he's just making arrows for me. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Oh my god. Right, okay. I have the saddle. I has it. Let's now. Has the Nightwing. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, I'm, it's terribly slow. <laughs> it's terribly slow. The stamina isn't great, but I can already see things that I haven't been seeing before. There's an egg. And there is a chest. God, the stamina drops ridiculous. Like, this is an early game flyer. This is an early game flyer. The actual land, but that's fine. Oh, I can open from it as well. Palosphere, copper key. Get you on there. I can just now fly around all the heights of the mountains and just collect all of the good stuff. This is cool. This is cool. It's a shame the stamina bar isn't great and it's a shame it isn't quick. I would have loved it if it was like it's just stupidly quick everywhere. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Um, maybe there's other flyers in the game that are quicker. I'm also out of stamina. It doesn't seem like as if it, I don't know if it takes fall damage. Don't know. We have to test this a little bit more. But I have so far got a large verdant egg and a rocky egg. Which is cool. We need to test its attacks out. So let's hopefully maybe not I'll find all those penguins. Oh my god, they're all here again. They're still here. <laughs> they're still here. Okay, so that just fires an air blast at them. Um, just like um, the mal the malpacker malpacker he does the same thing. What does this do? Oh, oh, oh! God damn! God damn, boy! Oh, oh my God! He's getting wrecked again. Run away! Run oh my God! Nightwing! Nightwing! Oh my God! Nightwing! He's dead! <laughs> He's dead again! What is happening? Why are they so violent? The penguins are so violent. My god, he killed the freaking Nightwing again. No. No. Little shit. Get wrecked. Naughty. 
Oh my god. This, oh my god. It broke through my shield. I'm gonna die. Oh my god, I'm frozen! I'm frozen! <laughs> what on earth are these things? Why are you like this? Ah! Why are you like this? I did nothing to you. Ugh. Oh my, oh my god. He died. <laughs> I really don't know why they're all so mean. I wonder if I can... Um, see, that really hurts him. Really hurts him. As soon as I attack back, I'm screwed. But I do need all the ice organs so I can make the... Um, I need to be able to make a bridge. I do want a rush bore as well. I do want a rush bore. Hit it. Yes. Oh, it's gone. <laughs> oh, his friend's come. His friend wants a bit. Oh, I killed his friend. He's he glitching out of the water, bro. <laughs> what's, what's happening? Oh my god. No, you, you come onto the. You come onto the. Oh, there's another one over there. Oh, everyone's in. Everyone's fighting now. <laughs> uh. Uh. Not my mel packer. No. You were supposed to just die. Violence is the enemy. Did I kill them all? I killed them all. I killed them all. Oh no, there's more. Oh my god, there's more. Everyone's fighting me. No, leave me alone. Leave me alone. We're in the fight of our lives. I can't even air cannon anymore. Oh, he's out of stamina. Oh, he's dead. Oh, shit. Ugh. No roof ball. Stupid penguin. Die. Ugh. Rush ball. You'll be my friend. Can't kill him. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Another penguin. I think we're good. We're all flapping. <laughs> right, we got a rush bar out of all that. Um, and we did manage to get uh, nine of the ice organs. And we need five. So it means that we can actually build the fridge and um, again elevate our base place, which is brilliant. Let's take a minute to revive the Nightwing and review him thoroughly without him getting absolutely beasted on by everyone's penguin in the world. Okie pokey. Been a little while. We've still got our thug just walking around with his bad red eyes. Her red eyes? Their red eyes. And um, yeah, we've been busy. We've melted some stuff. We've built some stuff. And I believe our Nightwing should now be healed. Oh. Lovely. There we go. Let's put the Nightwing back in. Let's actually try this correctly. We've also got the op opportunity to build the cooler box as well, which I'm going to put just over. In fact, I'm going to put it inside, I think. It's going to be there to stuff. So let's pop this inside. Like so. Put it near the window, because I think some of the creatures like work through the window. I don't know if they can fit inside the house. Um, but hopefully the pink will be able to Cool it down. We're gonna just leave that to build while we mess about with the night. Oh, he's inside. Oh. Then you let yourselves in. <laughs> I do love how fast it builds compared. It was like 50 seconds. And now you're not even got a chance to help look. You're too slow. Fat duck. But it means we can put eggs and stuff in there now, which is cool. It means we can do another base upgrade, which is even better. You go here now, like so. Base upgrade. Boom. Maximum pals work in here. Increased. Which means we can get... Uh, do you do ice? Do you do water? Water, water, water. Do you do ice? Do you need a fire? Fire. There we go. And we're good. We're in a good place now. The base is in a good place. As you can see. We have things built. It's looking nice. Things are looking organised. And... Um, yeah. let's, be, let's, let's actually try the Nightwing. Maybe on the crevice. <laughs> uh, cannon? 
Oh wow. <laughs> oh, well, we were. That's pretty powerful, but it was against a low uh, one. So let's try the tornado attack. To do this. I thought, did that hit anything? I don't think it hit anything. I think they all ran away. It looks like a cool move. I've just leveled up. Um, it looks like a cool move, but it doesn't look like I can actually do anything with it. Let's try again. If I do it on this one here, look. Oh, nope, nope, that worked. <laughs> that worked. Is that very good in trees? Okay, that's pretty cool. My issue is its stamina. Being honest. My issue massively is the stamina and the, the speed isn't as great as I wish it was. It's not bad. But it, it could be so much better. It could be so much better. We know it. Do this. Then, oh, yeah, I hit it. Okay. So you hit it with the wings. It still works. Okay. Yeah, it's the stamina. The stamina is not great. Um, and the speed isn't great either. I mean, you can... Fly. Let's see what happens when you run out of stamina. You just kind of drop. It doesn't take damage. You just kind of drop. I wonder what happens over water. Let's try it over water as well. As a final final bit of a test. Let's try it over water. There's some water in the middle here somewhere, isn't there? Yeah, there's water in the middle. Let's go to this one. It's a bit closer. I'm interested to see what happens with that. A little bit of lag. Palsphere. So, the tornado attack seems decent. If you can get it like that. But then again, these are only level 2. So it's not like we're having a big old fight or anything. Which is a bit of a shame. Let's try the water in the middle. There's also a chest and a fruit tree there. Just really want to see. I go really high. I could die doing this. But I think it's going to wait for us to see. Really high up. We've run out of stamina. We're plummeting. We don't die and we float on what? Okay, and we've also got a cape. What is this? Ooh, isolated dungeon boss. So that's good. At least you know if you fall out of stamina, you're just going to fall. Nice arrows as well. Which is good. Um, Yeah, basic flyer. Not bad. I can get everywhere I need to get on, on it. Uh, electric. Ooh, skills. Grass food. Seize mine. Iceberg. Very cool. I didn't know you could do that. So I'm guessing they must be types of the uh, pals that you can like. Like a TM. Like a Pokemon, I guess. Interesting. Interesting. Well, we have a flyer. It means we can go where we want to go. I have kind of explored in the stream. I was like over here. Um, there's a quiver just over there, level 23. Um, and we've got some bamboo and stuff. So we've done a bit of exploring, but I want to go high up. I want to go high and I eventually want to build a base up there. That's the plan. Maybe not in Edris Ed but up there. That's the plan, but that is all for today, guys. I really hope you've enjoyed watching Pal World with me. And we're about to run out of stamina, so we'll start dropping any. But don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Let us know if you want to see some certain things in the game, and we'll make sure that happens. Don't forget to watch the streams, and we'll definitely see you in the next one.